Ciao, what's going on? Welcome to some uh, ranked replays. We haven't watched ranked replays in a while, but we're going to watch a few ranked replays today that happened less than a week ago uh, between Fahad and Ashley. Fahad going to score first. Fahad and the orange team and Ashley in the blue for this first game. Both these guys very highly rated. Um, if you don't know who these players are, Ashley is the top ones player from England who has one arm, plays with, I believe, his chin, and uh, is it his left or right arm? I actually don't know. But he's unstoppable. He is shown to be one of the top mechanical players despite what seems like should be a disadvantage. He's proven that it isn't. It isn't anymore. Playing against Fahad, one of the top Middle Eastern players. Fahad 77. Winner of some big ones tournaments and highly rated for a long time. These guys had four games against each other all on the same day uh, earlier this week. Yo, thank you for the prime, CGB09. Get some prime OMGs in the chat. Ashley is really, really mechanical. I think uh, one thing that's going to be fun about watching Ashley replays is he is the guy who puts his replays automatically on ball chasing. So you end up seeing a lot of replays reviewed from Ashley. But he is one of the most mechanical players um, we've seen play 1v1. We've got to get him in a few live matches. But for the most part, it is hard to grab the EU players due to our time zone. A nice demo. And will he rush this one past? He will. Fahad respawns. But can't get next to uh, Ashley before he gets that one last touch. Oh, what up, CGB09? Smooth Brain. What's going on? Smooth Brain was a guy I played with uh, in ranked sometime last week, I think. Fahad should be given an open net here. Ashley was trying to pinch this ball on the side wall up out of the way of Fahad, but instead he just accelerated the play and put himself out of position. It's going to be an easy touch for a guy like Fahad who can play quick. Ashley risking a dive deep into Fahad's corner and it's not going to work. Great punishment right now from Fahad for the past two goals. Ashley playing a little bit aggressive. Fahad not going to let it happen. As he takes the ball straight to the net. I would expect these to be very close. If somebody is going to have the edge, you have to assume it's Ashley. Right now, Ashley's sitting a little bit higher on the leaderboard than Fahad is. He has been hovering around the top 20 range for a long time. Fast just got a lot better. Yeah, I'd be down to have Fast on again, too. I think Fast is not online right now. Um, but Fast just seems to be hard on the grind. Fahad, wow, miracle that he came away with this one. Ashley playing super safe at a slow roll. Fahad was in a super awkward spot, but for whatever reason, Ashley decided not to go and dive in. Instead, he's going to get this ball on the top of his car. Fahad will take it away, and a nice turtle goal for Fahad. He got tips from iRicky, fast training with iRicky. That, that can be a good recipe. Fahad. Taking control of this possession up 4 3. A soft flick. Ash is going to be able to easily save it away. And somehow found that corner boost. He's mostly just looking for the demo. But now that he's got the 100. Oh, look. Did not find the far post. Was trying to look low far post after Ashley had to commit to the previous save. But shot a little bit wide. And man, he's playing so aggressive right now. He's just been diving on Ashley at every opportunity and again he stays so so aggressive seems like ashley would have had an opportunity to chip it past him but man he is just turning at every possible moment you have to expect ashley to start to recognize that and adjust his gameplay fahad almost a nasty double on the near post 4-3 fahad once again has earned possession his air dribble is not set up well for the flip reset instead he just Chips it off the ground. Ashley being so, so defensive. Does not want to go for that ball and risk losing a 50. So instead, tries to react to the goal line shot. And an air dribble bump will get Fahad off the ball. 4-4. Four, four. He's going to tie it back up with a minute 43 left to go. This match is interesting. Yes, these guys are very, very high level players. Ashley, the kickoff goals. There's definitely a good amount of kickoff goals in this series. Despite the... Uh, Scoreline not being too incredibly high. They have been trading back and forth and then, you know, going for long, long routes or, you know, times where neither one of them are scoring. Ashley, gonna get a six, six, four.
He was having a tough time in this game, but a couple kickoff goals gives him a little bit of cushion. Ashley, can he recover from this bump? He will not, man. These two guys are just running it up right now. Score after score after score. Neither one of them lasting very long immediately after kickoff. Even these kickoffs that have seemed fairly neutral. You know, neither one of them clearly getting an advantage right away, but both of them trying to milk it for everything it's worth until one of them is out of position. Nice bump from Fahad onto Ashley. Ashley's going to try and play the possession game. Needs to take it all the way to this far corner because he does have Fahad hovering right behind him. I have to imagine Fahad is going to be looking to take this ball away as soon as he can. He has not wanted Ashley to have possession for more than a half second. Ashley, a good dodge. The demo and the flick. Fahad saves it away. Ashley thought maybe he could milk out a shot attempt with very little boost. He's playing backwards. He's only 22. Certainly, he's going to have to retreat. And now he's got Fahad coming straight down the center of the map. And the cut and goal with 30 seconds left to go. Fahad tying it up. Any show matches planned? Um, not right now. Hopefully we can get some going, but I couldn't find any going. But we got a nice ranked replay to start today off. Great arrow shot from Fahad. A fake, and Ashley doing a good job not to commit too hard to the first one. A really soft single jump to make sure he got back down to the ground, but then Fahad to low 50 and a hook shot. 7-6 for Fahad with 10 seconds left to go. These guys have been trading back and forth all game long. But with 10 seconds, Fahad looking like he has the lead. A good kickoff in his favor. Will he play it towards the net? He will, but a feels backflip, whether intentional or not. He's going to hand over possession to Demo. The ball will hit the ground. And of the four ranked replays we have today, Fahad will take the first. All right, game number two between Ashley and Fahad. We've got four of them. Fahad taking the first. We are on uh, Salty Shores night now. Beautiful. You never know what you're going to get since uh, ranked you can't control, but I love a good Salty Shores night. Fahad has played super aggressive. Um, we are watching all these games in the order that they happened. So I wonder if we're going to see Ashley. Wait a second, this is going to be a nutty shot. Ashley! Oh, can't get it. A full dribble from the corner. The flip, re flip reset is not in, and oh no, Fahad with the bump. Ashley lands awkwardly. And his reward for that great shot attempt is a goal the other way. Fahad up 1-0. I imagine we'll start to see some adjustments from Ashley. Some early touches. I think he can afford to make these really quick plays like he did right there. Low on boost. Just an immediate flick with the way Fahad has been challenging. He's going to eventually catch him off guard and get some plays over the top of him. And as well as just immediate power shots when he's got an open net. Not a bad way to score. Scrub said he could see why everyone was hyping him up. Who are we talking about? Oh, your boy Daniel was partied up with Scrub on his stream. Oh, okay, gotcha. But a miss, and Ash is going to have a wide open net. He'll take it with a musty, because why not? Ashley electing to tap the ball into the wall instead of grabbing that boost. It's going to cost him. He's in a really tough position after losing that. If he tries to race to the boost, then Fahad is likely going to get a couple nice touches anyways. He'd prefer to kill the ball and then get both, but his greed in searching for both is going to get him scored on. This kickoff going off much better for him. Missed touch, though. I'm sure he wanted to put the pressure on Fahad right away. He had the boost advantage by picking up the corner, and now Fahad able to reset at midfield. So that advantage may be completely lost. He's going to have a hard time scoring this, but he is Ashley. So he tries to get a flip reset off the corner. Fahad, very patient. Uses a single jump wave dash to push it away. It's a 2 2. Fahad continuing to play aggressive in the open field. Coming to dive all the way into Ashley. Ashley, I'm surprised he got that ball bouncing in the air, but it's going to work out for him. I would have expected him to want to play on the roll, but he tried to set up on the bounce off the wall. 
to get the touch over Fahad, and he did. It just cost him his life. Nice backflip challenge. Those are tough to make. Fahad, can he bump Ashley far enough out of the way? He can. Man, Fahad has been playing so well in these games so far. Just milking his offense for everything it's got. This time, Ashley is going to get both possession and the boost. He's going to fall from the ceiling. We get to see a nice Ashley go so far, but he went for the fake on the high bounce. Fahad was able to cover it. Fahad has been playing some great defense, and Ashley actually had an open net there, but he could not get into the power shot like he wanted to. He had to slightly dodge Fahad as he flew past the ball, and that soft, soft shot was able to get saved away. Ashley, the ceiling reset. He needs to get this ball lower down to the ground. What a shot, and what a save. Those ones are a little bit easier to save when the player is having to redirect them further down to make them score, as opposed to changing the angle up. But nice cut and a third, finally for Ashley. So many great shot attempts. And that's gonna be the one that ends up scoring. Baja defense right now has looked amazing. It has only been plays out at midfield when Ashley gets the ball passed and gets an open net or kickoff goals that he's been able to score. But normally, Ashley, one of the better players, you know, scoring on isolated defenders back in their net. And Fahad has just proven to be the better player in terms of defending those. Fahad, wow, a nice shot. Not often are you able to score off the just a ground dribble, slight volley to himself, but the power from it is enough to catch Ashley off guard. 4-4, Ashley thinking about going to grab that midfield boost instead. Diving back to his back corner, beating Fahad out. Not a bad idea. As that should grant him possession, Fahad's going to have to spend some time getting all the way back to his corner boost. But man, every sort of dribble that Ashley takes on the wall, Fahad has been able to cover. Fahad the single jump bump, not going to connect. Ashley, the counterattack. That has been one of the main ways he's been scoring. I'm just so impressed with the defense from Fahad. I wonder if we're going to start to see Ashley move away from his normal irritable game that he's so good at. And we'll see if he just starts taking, you know, maybe some ground dribbles, some irritable bumps or something in net the way Fahad's been playing. But 6-4, kickoffs can always help. Despite how good it seems like Fahad's playing, Ashley is up in this game right now. He is going to go back again at Fahad this time in the air. His flip reset, he pops it over Fahad. Fahad coming to challenge with the ceiling. And Ashley certainly is going to be able to score this one. Finally, he gets one past Fahad. You know, shooters are going to shoot. At the end of the day, Ashley not backing off of his wall to air dribbles on those kickoffs, despite Fahad being able to stop them all, you know, ranked games long. It's going to say series, but they weren't necessarily playing a series. Wow, that was a nutty shot, too. Ashley some power slides to chip the ball away. It seems like as soon as he's got some space, he never takes just an easy open goal. He probably could have, you know, taken an early power shot and not needed to power slide it into it, but it was much fancier that way. Oh my goodness, Ashley! <laughs> All right, chat, he's popping off now. <laughs> and that was enough. Fahad had enough. That's the end of this <laughs> second replay. After the 9 forward lead and that clip, <laughs> Fahad says, All right, you get game number two. So one going both ways. And uh, we'll move to their third replay. Fahad in the Fennec now. Seeing if that can help him out in this ranked session against Ashley. He has won the first one. But Ashley with a very impressive end to game number two. Fahad played great defense for what was, you know, three to four minutes of the game. But in the final moments, Ashley just blowing it out with some crazy shots and some kickoff goals. This time he's going to score from the ceiling. Where is Fahad? Wow, I can't believe he didn't score. Bit of a mistake from Ashley. Trying to rush the ball maybe a little bit faster than he actually needed to because um, Fahad was nowhere to be found. Fahad, wow. Nice cut in. Seemed like a little bit of a risk. He had an opportunity to go grab that back corner boost, keep Ashley starved out, and normally dunking a defender on the goal line when they're that close to the ball could be disastrous. Uh, but Fahad had faith that he was going to get around it, and he was right. Fahad playing on zero boost. Trying to just stay grounded 
and work this ball out of his half. The first time he ever used the flip it's for a really soft clear. Ashley, the air dribble bumped did not do a good job of getting on the right side of the ball. He fell off to the left side where Fahad was going to be um, on that right side where he needed to make that bump attempt. Way too much of a boomer on a flick from Fahad. Yeah, holy flick is right. But way too much power. And almost found a tight angle. Ashley's going to have open field now. Baha does not like it when Ashley has open field. He's been coming to challenge right away. Ashley going to flick it immediately. Ashley, the double. He'll get his first. That flick reminded me of Rawas. Yeah, Rawas put on a boomer of a flick, but he somehow kept it down in the net, which is just crazy. Ashley trying to play quick from the wall, see if he can punish Fahad for coming all the way out to that midfield, but wasn't able to. Fahad, a great recovery. Ashley's been playing really good lately. Yeah, Ashley's a beast. Fahad, nice bump off the wall, and a second. Fahad has been the uh, aggressor for sure in terms of physical play. He has been looking for bumps at every opportunity. Ashley has been willing to play a more open field game. He has looked for basically only air dribble bumps. Nice long shot from Fahad. Great recognition of having an open net. Demo him as an insult to injury. Why not? What rank are these guys? You're just now getting into the pro players, so you're trying to learn them. Uh, both, uh, both are a supersonic legend, if that's what you're saying. They're both in the top 100. Ashley is somewhere in the top 20, I believe. Like 16, 17. Fahad, I think, was ranked 60, and that is as of today. Five days ago, not quite sure uh, what their ranks would have been in the top 100. Maybe higher, maybe lower. Fahad, his power shot saved perfectly, and the reward for a perfect save is an open net. Ashley going to have no trouble tapping in this one for a second. Ashley has the highest MMR by arm of any player. Yeah, it's not even close. It's not even close. Ashley trying to wave dash to push this one past Fahad. But cannot do so. Ashley trying his best to be patient on the goal line. I think a little bit fortunate that his flip went through the ball and connected on Fahad. This is the first time we've really seen a bump attempt, and Fahad should be able to score this one. He will. It was closer than he would have liked, but the side flip on a 4 2 lead for Fahad. Ashley not succeeding in joining the physical game. Great cut, whether intentional or not, by Fahad to get underneath the ball there, or underneath Ashley there, to make sure he couldn't take a shot on that kick-up attempt. Double jump bump, Fahad 5-2. Giving himself a nice lead with a minute 30 left to go. Ashley. Double jump bump. This is kind of what we expected to see from him. Instead of going for his regular air dribble plays. To be fair, he didn't have the boost. Nice pre-flip to pop that over Fahad. What a shot from Ashley. Ashley seemed like he was recovering in trouble. But uh, nothing works quite like a nutty pre-flip to chip the ball up over Fahad. And give himself a third. He's got a minute 14 to get two. And you know what? He's got a minute 09 to get one as he will once again pop the ball over Fahad at midfield. I wonder how poorly it would go for Fahad if he just started playing exclusively defense. He's played you know, fairly well on defense. I guess at the end of that last game, Ashley started to push it past him, but I'd say in this one, oh, Ashley, just like that, a minute left to go, he's tied it up. It seemed like Fahad was taking the game, but kickoff goals and quick plays off the kickoff can do a lot for you in terms of coming back. And now, Fahad's got to be worrying about taking back the lead and not just going to overtime. Ashley, the air dribble bump. Well, not the air dribble bump, the air dribble 50. And Fahad can't keep it out despite doing such a great job on those all night long. Doing no face cam. Not for these ranked replay reviews, no. But I will be back um, on screen, don't you worry. Fahad on the bounce dribble, he needed that touch. 
Might have been able to squeeze him on a tight angle past Ashley. Ooh, Fahad, way too patient. Don't know how he thought Ashley was just going to let him go in there. And nice shot again, man. A nutty play from Ashley. Fahad, in a time where he needs to be ultra aggressive, start taking some risks and work to get his one goal deficit back. He was playing that super safe. Ashley chaining wave dashes. Must feel pretty confident with 15 seconds left to go. Faha, the air dribble bump, and he's got a six. Yo, Odin over the prime. Thank you so much. Two months of priming with 10 seconds left to go. Faha needed this kickoff goal. Instead, Ashley's going to get it. I wonder if he plays this out or if he forfeit here. Yep, he forfeit here. 8 6. So two games going to Ashley, one to Fahad, but these have been close. We got one more to watch. All right, the fourth game, Fahad versus Ashley. Looks like Fahad has had enough of the Fennec back in the Octane. And Forbidden Temple Knight, man. This has been some great uh, maps so far. Sometimes you get some tough maps when you're watching rank replays, but these have been great. Fahad, a nice snake dribble in the first. We saw him score from that earlier in these rank replays. And going back to it at the beginning of this game. Do I play RL? Of course, man. Of course I play Rocket League. Fahad, a bump. He's got some open field. The hook shot on an open net. We'll get him a second. Fahad looking great at the start of this game, including this kickoff. He's going to force Ashley completely off the ball. Bounce dribble. And he tries to double touch it off the back wall. That'll be the end of the nice early streak. Yeah, thank you for the host for 1 million viewers. Appreciate it. Who won game three? So, of the three games we've watched, Fahad won the first, Ashley won the second, and third. This is the fourth. Fahad thought he saw an opening on that right side of the net. Wow. Not often you see one's players do this. The reverse play, players will not stay in reverse very long. But for whatever reason, Baja thought this was the opportunity as he tried to reverse back behind the ball. It's such a slow play, you'll see a lot of lower ranked players discouraged from doing that whenever they're given advice by somebody. But Baja thought he had an opportunity to use it wisely and it didn't work out. Ashley in open field. Faha missing that pinch on the wall. Trying to stop this aggressive play. Or trying to stop this uh, play from the wall by flying up to pinch it. Just didn't connect. Ashley tapping it past Faha. Didn't have the boost to get around the ball. And get a shot before Faha would have recovered. Ashley, did he get the flip reset? Is he going to go for a double here? Oh, he just barely missed. Got Fahad to miss on the first touch, but couldn't get back around it. Fahad accidentally lobbing that ball. I don't think he meant to do that. Getting up into the tornado spin without actually using his flip. He basically flicked the ball so far away from him, enough that he couldn't get back to make another play. But a demo and another goal. Fahad has been using the demo game very well. And he'll tie it up. This is 3-3. Three three. This is the final replay we're going to be watching between um, Ashley and Fahad. Bounce dribble. The hook shot. Shooting near post. Tell you what. Shots like that have been coming out for a long time in the 1v1 meta. And it's still impossible to stop them. Yo, PTM Live. Get to the tier 1 to Lunar Brawler. Thank you so much. Uh, lobbing one up for Ashley. Able to help push him away. Pinch it off the backboard. The hype train continues. Hype train level two. Jeez, chat. Bada fifth. He has taken an early lead in every game. I'm not sure any of these games have gone uh, in the way of Ashley at the beginning of them. And it doesn't seem like Ashley's adjusting too, too much. He just somehow has found a way to get the edge in the last two. But 6-3. Fahad. Up three. Will this be enough? It was enough in game number one.
Ashley on the kickoff, sent back to his corner. Baja with the early challenge. Has gotten Ashley to react. He has been very cautious of Baja coming to take the ball away. But the first demo go for Ashley in a long time. As he slowly bounces it. Yo, Odner! Five gifted subs. My goodness, you guys are crazy. Is that instantly through the next phase of hype train? I don't understand how these hype trains work. But thank you so much. Ashley almost a long shot on an open net. And unfortunately for him, the ball glues to the back wall. Thank you so much, Odner. Five gifted. It's huge. Big Darty Energy, Spleen Cuisine, Cube of Soup, Will W, and Darren96. Welcome to the crew, guys. Ashley. He has been going for these slow bounce dribbles the past couple attempts. Baja trying to bake them up on a near shadow. Baja to the back corner. Strong touch and a 50 and this should be a 7th. An interesting play to launch that one off his ceiling super high. Ashley obviously thought he saw an opportunity to take it away. But a great recovery. What is this no flip kickoff? This has got to be a goal. I bet you something weird happened. No flip kickoffs, we don't see them period anymore. But for whatever reason, Fahad no flip kickoffing. He's going to do it again. Is he doing this on purpose? He's going to lose it like crazy. I don't know if he's just trying to play basically a delayed kickoff. But even pe when people play delayed kickoffs, they usually go for the flip and then stop themselves short in order to kind of hide it. But Ashley going to get a sixth. Baja, for whatever reason, there's no way he goes no flip on these. Yeah, I'm not sure. I've never seen that before. Trying to run the no flip diagonal kickoff. And maybe he had had a hard time with Ashley's diagonal kickoff earlier in the series. Or earlier, like, playing them um, tonight. But it didn't seem like it. Maybe we weren't noticing, but all of the, uh, the kickoff wins for Ashley were coming off diagonals. An interesting mix-up. It's not going to cut it for him. Ash is going to get two goals and is now within one with 20 seconds left to go. Yo, Kiki Boy, thank you for the tier one. Two months of tier one. And appreciate it. Ten seconds left to go. Fahad, a deep challenge. Oh, man. Ashley had possession on the wall. Fahad coming in really deep on the fake challenge before driving away. And now it's going to be 7-7. Seven, seven. He lost his kickoff. He's actually going to score right away. He is. Oh, Ashley. 8-7 with a second left to go. A forfeit. Faha does not want to try and get the kickoff and keep it up. Oh, brutal. Ashley stealing a game once again in the final moments. But those are your four ranking plays. Ashley and Faha, good games. Both of them great players. Hopefully we can see more of them live one day.